brilliance of the sunrise is conducive to elation, as witness the exuberance of your felicitation. Such matutinal obeisance uh, should never die, Barney. So I return the Greek, or in other words, uh, good morning. Now, class will come to order. Take page 32. Assuming that you've studied, Miss Smith, you're late. Let's hear from you. My granite, don't know what I'm going to do with you. You're late practically every morning. Now, give it a count of yourself, yeah? Starting every lesson, on every page I turned, I couldn't get the answers, but this, at least, I learned. An apple for the teacher will always do the trick when you don't know your lesson in arithmetic. An apple for the teacher will with great success if you forgot to memorize the Gettysburg address a little bit of glamour a charm that's cute and quaint then he'll excuse your grammar and believe you're what you ain't you may be just a lemon but he'll think you're a peach just bring an apple for the teacher when he starts to teach yes bring an apple for the teacher I shall not be perplexed by charm or personality. Tommy Jones, you're next. And don't forget, young man, I want to see your father tonight. Yeah, you and Ma both. What do you mean, me and Ma both? She hasn't seen him in ten years. Now, Whitey, did you study your homework last night? I sure did. Let me hear it, please. I want the arithmetic. Well, now that you're repentant, I suppose I should relent. So let us then continue uh, with the music of uh, Rudiment. Do -re -mi.
Jane Smith? Yes, dear teacher. You know your lessons for today? Yes, teacher. Dear, dear teacher. Just stop red appling me and let's get started here. Gentlemen, uh, this is your chorus. I'd like everybody to join in. Come on now, don't be backward. Everybody sing. Ready? One, uh, two. Let's try it again. <laughs> 